The Drag Now, Drag Forever theme, Greater Palm Springs Pride, is underway in Palm Springs. News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price is live in the Arenas District tonight in Palm Springs with a look at what's ahead through the weekend. Miyoshi. Hi, John. That's right. I'm live right here on Arenas in downtown Palm Springs, where Broadway in drag competition will take the big stage later tonight at 7. But at the same time, there'll be live performances at Margaritaville called Dragalicious. And also many local bars and hotels are hosting their own live performances and parties throughout this long weekend. But drag, it has been controversial across the country. And Palm Springs Pride, they say it's entertainment and it's art. Always remember, drag is not a crime. We're here to entertain. Greater Palm Springs Pride officials say across the country there are over 700 bills and measures that they believe are on the books to cancel their art and self-expression. Steve White, also known by his drag queen name, Sasha Meadows, says everyone has a purpose and one of his is drag. I love to entertain. Um, it's, a, it's, it's a way of, of expressing yourself in, in a different way. Um, it's a, a, to, to go, go out and feel and feel fabulous and, and glamorous. And this is an opportunity for us to really stand up and support our drag community who have been performing and part of the entertainment landscape for literally several hundred years. City Council Member Ron DeHart is also the director of Palm Springs Pride. He says, yes, it is political, but it is also a fun event for all to join in on. There are a number of drag queens that are being recognized uh, with our honors and the Grand Marshal is the oldest living working drag queen, uh, Gypsy. And uh, you know, so we're, we're, we're uh, raising the level on recognition for our local drag queens. And this year, there are many options for entertainment, not just drag shows. Crews are setting up multiple stages in the downtown Palm Springs area, ready to highlight big names like Lisa Lisa and Adina Menzel and more. I'm very excited to see Lisa Lisa. Why? Because she's great. I love dancing to her music. It makes me feel good. It's just fantastic. I'm really not familiar with the activities, but I'm, I'm slowly finding out what's going on and I'm just hopping from here to there and I'm enjoying myself and it's fantastic. Palm Springs Pride officials say this event is open to everyone, no matter your sexual orientation, gender, race or religion. I've been to many prides. I have to say Palm Springs is the most relaxing, fun uh, pride I think I think ever. Now this weekend, you will be able to join a 5K run. They'll have a youth zone that you all can attend. There are so many things throughout this four-day weekend pride a list of events. If you want that list, go to our website at KESQ.com. But out here, we're having a really good time. Vendors are out selling food, and we're just having a good time. So come on down. I'm live in Palm Springs, Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3.